are test cutting the Smart Acrylic with a Tremol. There we go. It's definitely not straight for sure. There's like a slight, there's a slight angling um, along it. And that's just because we can't actually hold this flat. So this time we're going to try cutting it with a jigsaw. So here we have the finished initial starting edge, just for reference, so you get that uh, cool looking pattern again. Um, then we have a uh, jigsaw cut edge, which looks uh, pretty good. It's a little bit more diffuse, um, depending on where you put it. And then we have a dremeled edge here, which is the awkward angle. Uh, and you can see it's a lot more diffuse. We're preparing some aluminum foil tape. It's really shiny on both sides. So we're going to put one on the, uh, the still polished finished side, and then one on the, uh, the non-finished side over here and see if we can reflect off from, from finished across bounce off this side or unfinished bounce off this side and see what happens. So that looks a, quite a bit more uh, Glowy. more solid, right? So it looks like the aluminum tape is doing its job. So here, after experimenting with making the back more reflective, we're trying out what it looks like to have the back be as non-reflective as possible. So yeah. we're grabbing some black fabric from a beret. A beret. Yeah. Uh, oh wow, okay. That's actually uh, very good. There's a lot There's a lot more contrast uh, with the black on, but with the black off you can see things behind it. So that's kind of cool. So here we're testing using a knife to, to etch some patterns in aluminum backing. There's still a lot of residue uh, left over, so again, if you can uh, avoid putting tape on and then taking it off, I would totally do that. Okay, that's actually pretty interesting. It looks as though, it looks almost as if it was etched. So as you can see, with a, uh, a heated bend, the light actually flows around the corner and into the other part of the acrylic. So that's with a simple blue LED. We're attempting to drill into the acrylic as a way of mounting an LED. So this is our attempt to hot glue the LED into the hole we pre-drilled. There's a more even diffusion.